هاي ويلكم باك تو سين باي مايا اليوم رح نحكي كيف سيريز انسباير فاشن ورح نحكي باللغتين بالانجليزي وبالعربي I know I talked about series two weeks ago, but today we're going to talk about how series inspire fashion and not the other way around. Leash, not the other way around. Tarfo into no Sex in the City, Gossip Girl, or lately, for example, Younger. How do the series be able to product placement? Those series are series where the outfits are worn as they are by the stars and then they are in all the blogs and the blogs and people go and buy the same outfits. This is not the subject of today. Today we're going to talk about how historical or, or fiction series inspire directly the street and the catwalk. Our first series today will be Mad Men. We're going to talk about Mad Men. It's the first series that you have to take من بعد ما بلشوا الموفيز ياخذوا اقل رهجه وبلشت تطلع الموديد سيريز اكثر تقريبا من 10 سنين. Mad Men is about those advertising guys on Madison Avenue that's why it's called Mad Men and it happens in the late 50s the early 60s and um, at that time about one year after the series started we discovered complete collections complete pret collections for example the Louis Vuitton one inspired exactly from even the decor of the series not only the outfits like the dresses the hairdos etc and this is very weird because at the time it was not the fashion and this is how this vintage style came into trend the next series we're going to talk Downton Abbey one of my favorites we're going to talk about Eileen Grantham who are living in Downton Abbey and the other aristocracy في انجلند وقتها كان عم يتغير وجه الارستوكراسي عم نحكي تقريبا عن الارلي 20th century at the time that the titanic crashed يلي صار بهيدي السيريز انه هالفاشن الموجوده فيها يلي هي ابدا مش براكتيكال للدي تو دي وير كان سو نايس انه مش بس لوي فويتون لوي فويتون وغالف لوران وطمي هيل فيجر حتى يلي هو اتس your American brand in your face يعني. كلهم they were inspired directly by Downton Abbey and even if the coats were not practical and easy to wear uh, they were full of materials and they were heavy yet they sold, they sold like crazy in the shops آخر example رح نحكي عنه اليوم our last example for today is The Handmaid's Day الغريب بهاي the series and all there are only like three outfits that women wear either the handmaid's one which is completely red or the wife's one which is completely blue or uh, the lady that's uh, governing the house uh, which is completely brown so there's nothing else fashion behind the series and yet and yet not only one but two or even three and four designers completely rahofia so Valentino and a whole series of dresses and outfits total look red. كيف معقول هل أدي نكون inspired by a series even if it's like something scary. وحتى Paul Smith مثلا Paul Smith يعني هو إذا بتكون English with a twist. It's not really his style إنه يعمل هيك شيء. أنا عملنا total look red. So أنا سؤال بس أكون اليوم is our daily daily life so boring that we want to feel like we're living in series? Tell me, what do you think about it in the comments below? And I'll put some links also for all the pieces that I wrote in the previous years about this. And also, I'll see you next week.